Mark Edwards, President and CEO of Kane Biotech. And these are our offices at the 100 Innovation Drive in the University of Manitoba Smart Park. You do that through titration. Kane Biotech is specialized in the development and discovery of technologies that inhibit and disperse microbial biofilm. We're really the biofilm company. Microbial biofilm is like a glue. And that glue does two things to the bacteria. That's bacteria. It allows them to attach to a surface and make them very, very hard to remove. And it creates this protective layer that makes them very hard to kill by uh, antibiotics and antibacterial. Biofilms make bacterial infections very, very hard to treat. So we have technologies that break down these biofilms and make the bacteria planktonic. So without that protective layer or that glue, that allows them to attach the surface, makes them a lot easier to kill. We'll say a thousand times easier to kill. And what do we use the conductivity for? Uh, to release raw materials. Some of the things they do in the micro lab is they're analyzing for biofilm and testing our technology against biofilms that we develop in-house. Yeah, it's a lot of transfers and a lot of detailed work that happens because we're dealing with organisms that are very, very tiny yeah. and they have to get the dilutions correct so that we can analyze them properly and actually represent the true world environment. So the first biofilm that was detected was on our teeth. We actually started off in the animal health space with a water additive that you put in your dog's drinking water. We've got multiple products. So we've got a, a wound care hydrogel. We're very excited about, we announced last week that we had formulated that gel into an aerosol so you could easily be sprayed on and can easily be rinsed away with cool water. We've got a great line of shampoo with a scalp detoxifier. We know that it's the same, we know that it's, it's uniform. We have a very um, interesting group here, I must say that. Uh, very talented and really fun to work with. It's definitely a challenging environment, everybody's extremely busy but we managed to take some time to have a few laughs uh, on a regular basis. <laughs> and I think this group is very close and it works very well together. There aren't a lot of homegrown companies operating in Manitoba, right? You'll have large companies that have facilities here. So being able to have the support of organizations like BAM really goes a long way in helping us move what we're doing forward.